hi guys welcome or welcome back to my channel in today's video i am going to be showing you guys how to get rich and adopt me it's super fast super easy and i'm going to show you guys how i got all of these mega legendaries and how you can also do the same before we get started make sure you go check out my roblox profile and my roblox group which will both be in the description down below also be sure to check out my social medias instagram and tiktok which are both on the screen okay without further ado let's get started okay so first on my list you want to have a grinding house basically a grinding house is a house where you can complete most tasks like the shower task food um playground um sleep the only task you cannot complete is the hot spring the school task the hospital um things of that sort those are the ones you cannot complete in your house but the rest the most that comes you can complete them at your house and it's super easy make sure you have multiple items like you see i have multiple beds multiple showers multiple food okay and the second tip is to hatch eggs um hatching eggs really help you because when you hatch them you get new pets and you can hatch multiple of them and if you get the same four pets make a neon if you get 16 make a mega and you can just work your way up and that's super helpful you can buy this cracked egg this is the cheapest one out of all of them for 350 bucks and the gumball machine um every few months or so it changes eggs so right now is the woodland egg you can buy that for 750 rope that's not robux for bucks adopt me cash um yeah and that switches out um you can possibly trade these like really really far in the future maybe it'd be more rare it won't be as rare as like the safari ad the jungle ad because mm, people weren't really playing around that time but like the aussie egg it's not that rare it's kind of rare but not that rare because more people starting to get into the game myself was starting to get into the game too around that time so those won't be as rare but you can still possibly trade them for multiple pets and you know make the neons make the megas and especially with the new update with the new um pets in these eggs these eggs are like really the update been out for about a week so the eggs are still kind of popular because a lot of people want like more the new pets i know i see people making megas neons all of that with the new pets so Get you some eggs, hatch them, level up the pets, and I'm sure you can get overpaid. Okay, so I talked about this kind of with the hatching the eggs. So this is kind of part of that, but we're just going to make it a tip. It's to make neons and megas. A lot of people are neon collectors and mega collectors, and I'm sure like when new pets come out, you can make neons and people will overpay for it because some people don't really feel like making them another tip is to watch youtube videos to help out with trades say i'm trading my mega parrot for example i look up youtube videos trading mega parrot and i can watch those videos see kind of what the offers are looking like see what i can get for my mega parrot if i'm thinking about a trade and I see that people, multiple people are getting offered way better, then I can say no thank you to that trade and that could possibly be, be helpful because it might be a lose. The next tip is to make an alt account and an alt account helps me so much. Adopt Me hasn't released an update yet where you can carry two pets without being in a family but that's okay because you have your alt account. I can carry two Neon Sasquatch at the same time and be able to do the task and I earn extra bucks. If you feel like doing it, have two alt accounts. I have about four alt accounts. I mean that's how I'm able to make megas and stuff. Just a little snippet of my inventory. That's how I'm able to do it. I know a lot of people ask. There it is. I have about that many alt accounts they help so much like i know this is like an obsession 
but it's really not. On my laptop, I have about two accounts together. My iPad, I have an account. On my phone, I have my other alt account. So that's three alt accounts and my main account. So that's four accounts I'm dealing with to help me make a neon. Or on each account, I have four neons to make a mega. Like that really helps. That becomes very useful over time. Next, this kind of um, goes with the YouTube videos and the TikTok videos. Do not, do not, do not, do not, do not overpay for any pet. A lot of people don't listen. That's why in one of my um, earlier tips with the hatching eggs, I said, oh, a lot of people like to overpay for the new eggs and stuff new pets if you make neon da 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 but you don't do that i know this might sound like a little cruel but let others overpay for your pets and stuff don't do the same to theirs don't overpay for theirs every trade you do at least try to make it a win for you or there for the both of you don't try to overpay especially 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 if it's your dream pet i find a lot of people who would overpay for their dream pet even though it's their dream pet later regret the trade do not do that okay guys so i really hope you enjoyed this video i hope this video was also very helpful if it was make sure you go ahead and like and if you haven't already subscribe turn on the post notifications so that you do not miss another great video from me Make sure you comment down below what other videos you would like to see from me. Um, maybe you can give some tips of your own in the comments. I would love to read them. Okay, thank you so, so, so much for watching. See you guys in my next video. Bye!